The mommy wars have probably done more damage to our relationships among each other as women than anything else in modern culture. So we have one end of the spectrum of women who work outside the home who are elevated by our culture as doing good and valuable work. And they feel the need to justify themselves against the Christian subculture, which elevates the work of the home as the best thing a woman can do. So we've got both ends of the spectrum, women who work outside the home who are justifying their existence by uh, against a Christian subculture, and we've got women who are inside the home who are justifying their existence against a culture that tells them their work is not valuable. And the Bible doesn't give us any mommy wars. It doesn't give us any work pitted against the other. Instead, the Bible tells us that in the beginning, God created male and female to work. He created us for good and valuable work. So the work that we're doing is part of being an image bearer. And so we're not looking at one work as better than the other. We're looking at each other saying we should be each other's cheerleaders. We should be each other's encouragers and telling them that the work they're doing is valuable. The work they're doing is good and not trying to make ourselves feel better because we feel threatened by a culture that doesn't think our work is valuable. We need to look at God's word who says, God who tells us that our work is valuable because we are created in his image. We were made to work and we can encourage the women around us in the work that they're doing, regardless of whether they're in the office or whether they're in the home. All work has value.